Okay, hello, welcome to another episode of Cisco's Adventure RPG. So, we got the soul sand we needed from last episode, so now we're going to, uh, waypoint our way back home. And I need to delete my old death waypoint, because, dear god, I died way too many times during that last episode. Uh, also, mob farm, and then we'll teleport back to the base to avoid that arrow that just got shot at us. Uh, I found a bastion ring and some stuff, but that's irrelevant. Um... What else did we, we just needed gold, right? It was just five gold and a bell for the haunted bell. Yep. Dope. We just need one, so we'll just do one. Uh, I do need to uh, fix our bow, though, so give me one moment. Okay, there we go. Now we're ready to go kill the bell ringer. So let's do this. Hopefully our bow doesn't explode again. I'm going to do it in... Uh, the open space over here, not on the ice, because the ice is, uh... If you guys saw last episode, we, I don't want to talk about it. But, uh, yeah, some stuff happened over here, and I, I'm just not going to talk about it, because it's, it's not worth it. It's not. It's just not. Not, not worth it. Anyways. Bell ringer time. Wait, so he's just like an actual... Okay, this is actually like an interesting fight, because I... He's dropping stuff on us, he's like doing these sweeping attacks. Yeah, and they, they actually don't hurt too bad, especially with the, the other stuff that we've gotten before. But he's going kind of all out now, which is... Uh, actually worrisome. We might need a golden apple here, but... Wait, I got a melee hit on, on him? Wait, wait, where'd he go? Dropping stuff on our head now. Come on, come down. Come down for a melee hit. Come on. I know you like that. I know you like that. My sword hits for quite a bit, don't it? Where the hell do you go? Oh, there he is. There you go. He's over here now. And we got the Phantoplasm. Wait, we got two Phantoplasm. Big. Um. Okay, so what did we need for the Spectre's Grasp? Just some gold. Perfect. So now we get the Spectre's Grasp. And that's another slot thing to go in our hand. Now we have our bundle slot. We also have the Spell Focus and Bangle. Uh, but also the Head. I don't know what we have for Head slot. Um... Well, there's one from this, which is the Blossoming Mind, so let's look. Uh, head slot. Um, Emperor's Crown. I don't know where you get that from in Blossoming Mind, which we need the Violet Bloom, which comes from the other thing. Or Spectre's Eye might be nice, actually. Wait, so Spectre's Eye will just be this stuff, too. We already have the stuff we need, so... Spectre's Eye. Dope. Does it just... <gasps> That's sick. I love it. I love it. That's just... Oh my gosh. Uh, also, I'm thinking about increasing... You know what? We'll just do it now. Um, Curios. Add... Ring. 
Noble Cactus 8. Because now, we actually have ring slots for the amount of fingers that we have. Because not having them is stupid. I just don't understand it. Anyway, now we can get all of these uh, rings on, which is dope. So, big, big value. Um, hmm. We're going to need a lot more stuff, though. So, uh, I'm going to have to work on that. But it's going to be okay. So now we got all our ring slots. Four more. We also have the belt. Uh, I don't remember. Is there a good belt item? Belt. The belt. Um, belts. Belt of bracing. And then there's all those. Sandstorm in a bottle. Belt. Uh, sandstorm in a bottle is interesting. That's turning into a sandstorm, which is... Eh. Boots and the charm stuff. We'll fill that later. But we also have a storage system, which is quite cool. Uh, so we're going to be organizing all of our stuff and chucking some of it into there. But first, we also have to take care of quite a bit of other things. Uh, also, is there any... It's not look to be, but there are... There's a ring of speed in here. Pretty dope. That's a rare ring. Of course, these guys are... Oh. Wait, epic? Rare. Common, epic, epic, epic. Wait, so that means, so we ju we just don't, we can't get the flight without uh, going through this, right? Oh, we need to kill them all. That, that's fine, okay. Uh, Night Lich, we can probably get maybe this episode, actually. Also, let's just do this. Pick up the coins, champions trials. We've been in the nether, and uh, nothing too crazy. Uh, we also have netherite, which is dope. Get some Wither Skelly Skull from that. We also got the scroll. Wisdom scroll. Dope. Uh, we can utilize that over here. For one more armor point. Just sick. Uh, what else do we have in here? Uh, oh, Slay Petriman. Okay. Wait, we... Killing spiders is... What? Goblins... Rogue Knights, Gallants, or Frenzied Knights. Okay, so we just get good Wisdom Scrolls for those, too. Uh, I need Nether Quartz now. Sh strange. Do I have Nether Quartz in any of my stuff? Did I use it all already? Um. Well, let's go grab some Nether Quartz. Can't hurt to grab some more. There's always plenty in here as well. But getting the next set of armor uh, fully upgraded is going to be a chore and a half. But I'm quite looking forward to it. It's going to be so worth it. Because it's going to be so good, too. Like, oh my gosh, you guys have no idea. It's going to be beautiful. So. Quartz. Dope. Uh, gem cutting table. We need that too. Oh. The bright steel alloy. I don't have bright steel alloy. I have bright steel. I got I don't got the alloy. What does it take to get the alloy? Hey, can y'all stop that please? Okay, Jesus. We just like taking damage, I guess, because we're stupid. Um Okay, so I need the bright steel alloy, but how do I get the alloy instead of the normal bright steel? Martin the shiny, okay, so... Wait, is this what I used to make the... Huh? Is it because I had never unlocked... It's because I hadn't unlocked quartz yet. Of course it was. Dope. Um...
light core. Blaze rods with it too. Dark steel pickaxe is uh bright steel with dark steel, which dark steel is uh bright steel with netherite, so I need a bunch of netherite, okay. Dark steel mo There's a multi-tool. Perfect. Right, dark steel the pickaxe, you need a full full block but for the multi-tool you only need okay also this this sh thing is actually dope like it's it's so sick i just love it also i wish there was a way to get mending and infinity on a bow just because like infinity is so good I don't know, I just like my Mendy bow, because then it doesn't break, but if I can make it unbreakable, then I'll just go infinity. And I can make it unbreakable at some point. But anyway, apparently we can make bright steel with quartz, glowstone, gold, and that stuff, so... Uh... I'm gonna need to get some gold... Or some glowstone and uh, quartz, but we can... And start absolutely cranking it out. It's gonna be kind of kind of nuts, but oh my gosh, I'm going to absolutely adore it. But we already have the bright steel leggings, chest plate, that stuff, which is already pretty dope. Uh, the other thing that we need to do though is socket our stuff. Since we have 55 levels, why not? Uh, God forged pearls, some gem dust. And we'll just do this. Uh, 150. Shoot, I need a lot of levels for that. What's the first one? Uh, 13. Frosted Ancient Knowledge. Weakness. Uh, uh, 41% durability damage. You know what? Worth it, I guess. I'll take that too. It's nothing super crazy, but we'll take it. And then I think I'm gonna end it here. I mean, there's just not much else to really realistically do. Uh, yeah, shoot. We just, I'm just gonna go back to the mob farm for a bit. <laughs> go absolutely even more crazy. Uh, even though now we have almost four full, uh, bars of uh, stuff so that's kind of dope but i also need to move all of our stuff in and uh use the salvaging table to uncraft a bunch of stuff but anyways i will see you guys next time ggs peace have a great day i'll see you again next time bye 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 i know i said that twice